I just got a question about wet forming a, uh, a holster with a basket weave design. I decided to try it one day. I had the same question years ago and when I made my own personal concealed carry holster I did a basket weave on it and then um, well when I did the basket weave I had it laying flat then I stitched the two sides together and then wet formed it to fit the gun now it's not just formed to fit the gun but it's formed to have retention on the gun because this is an open top pancake style basket weave holster this is my own personal concealed carry holster like I said now the only place I lost any kind of detail was right in this area but mostly that's because I took and I took my black burnisher and I just really mashed it in there to get retention on the trigger guard I did the same thing on the back but other than that it really kept the detail of the basket weave you gotta make sure your stamping's good and deep so make sure that the uh, water content and all that's correct also I tried the same thing with the tri-weave stamp and you can see it kept the detail rather well even has good detail I think it's got pretty good detail even where the trigger guard goes right there but I did the same thing on this one except um, you know with a tri weave and I did it on this blue jean colored holster and same thing got good retention but I lost detail in this area but that's like I said like on the other one it's only because I really mashed it in so other than that it is possible to keep the detail of a basket weave pattern or a tri weave or any kind of pattern you put on it and wet form it as long as your stamping is good and crisp and deep. Alright.